Hi guys, so today I am back with another video and this video is it's a rather long video because what I'm doing is a legit drawing piece. It's like legit long term kind of drawing. I finished it in one day but it was in the span of like seven hours. This video you're seeing right now is basically six hours and 30 minutes condensed into a 10 minute video so everything would be rather fast. I filmed like the very beginning like from like the, my initial sketch like super rough sketch to like rough sketch line art to base color to painting over it so there's a lot going on in this drawing. Um, the main purpose of this drawing was I was going to enter this contest it's about ocean awareness, something like that about um, polluting our oceans because you know humans trash everything apparently. But yeah, I'm trying to do something. I'm trying to make more out of my art by entry competition. So I guess I can write it down my college applications. Like I have no idea. But I just really need to do something for college. And oh yeah, I'm gonna be pretty busy this summer. I have summer school, and then after that, I have like SAT classes, and then right after that, I start school. So it's pretty hectic right now, and I hopefully I have more time to draw because now you have those days where you're like, okay, I'm gonna draw today, and then you just like, oh, I'm so lazy. I I don't want to draw. I just want to chill and watch YouTube and play with my TS. Like that's how I feel every day. And when you are busy, you're like, oh, I want to draw, but I can't. So it's kind of like counterintuitive, I don't know. But okay, moving on to this. So like I said earlier, it's about ocean awareness. And what my what I imagine is, I'm a very like, fantasize? Like, do I fantasize a lot? I think I fantasize a lot. And I kind of make everything kind of supernatural than it should be. So what I imagine, the scene is okay so after years of polluting our oceans and trash building up you know the sea animals the fishes learn to adapt to our um, destruction by kind of have the ability by like having the adaptation to swim in the atmosphere and kind of like roaming instead of roaming in the ocean now they're kind of like roaming in our atmosphere and now it's kind of like fishes are kind of taking over but not really something like that and it's kind of like what's well, kind of inspired by what should we call it kind of reminds me of this one manga that I read like a year ago it was called like Gyo by Usumaki um God, I his name. <laughs> Junji Ito, yeah. I don't know why I said Uzumaki. That was like his other series. But it's like Junji Ito, it's about. It's what it's about. But I just remember it was about like a war weapon where they kind of make these sea animals. Are you rotting sea animals? Like fishes? Okay, it's just. Fishes can walk on land now. That's basically what it is. And, and that's kind of my imagination, but instead of like having these robotic legs walking on land, they're just magically flying everywhere so that was my idea for this picture oh yeah and I think I kind of passed this scene but I had like a pile of trash in the background and yeah it looks like a big messy blob of a bunch of random colors and that was because like the real reason was I was really lazy I didn't want to spend like, I don't know, three more hours working on trash and thinking about, okay, what should I put in that big pile? So let's kind of make a symbolic, let's make like, let's make it symbolic by saying, okay, it represents, you no know, the pile of trash until I got to this point where, you know, it's so, so much that it's undistinguishable. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just making, I'm like BSing everything right now. But yeah, that's my... Plan. I have to write a reflection about this later. It's like 250 words or less. I feel like I'm gonna go over. But yeah. I don't know. Hopefully, I place at least, like, you know, 
for this drawing. Honestly, I, I, I don't know, I kind of went overboard with the creativity, so I just feel like is it, what if they, get, they don't get my message? And I'm not sure how to spread awareness, but you know, it's, it's different, right? And people like different things, I guess. It's unique. Yeah, um, I had trouble. Okay, so what I want to do, when I usually draw, I usually start with the guy, right? The people first. And then I work on I would work on the animals and I work on the background. But for this I had to do the other way around because that's the that's how you should do things anyways. And it was because it was really messy. Like oh my god, this whole drawing was really messy. But I couldn't do like one layer of this. I had to do like two layers. Like have the guy in one layer and then the back with another layer and work on the background first and then merge it with the guy and finally do the one layer method. But it was I don't know, it just took for a very long time. It took me, like I said, one day, but it was in a span of like 7 hours. I started really late. I started like at what, like at 6, 7 p.m. and then I finished like at 2, 3 p.m.? 2, 3 p.m.? Yeah, around that time. And um, I'm sorry if it's a little bit loud. I have the air conditioning on and I think my laptop is starting to cool itself, so it might be some a lot of funky noises. What time is it? Oh my god, it's only been 6 minutes. What should I say? Okay, fishes. Okay, the fishes? Okay, those little fishes, I like DS them too. I was like, fuck this shit. I don't wanna, you know, spend time on drawing little fishes. I don't even draw fishes. This is the first time I've drawn fishes, like, ever. Yeah, and sharks, like, so that was like something new. I didn't know how to get, like, that realistic look to it. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna paint it like I can only do with other things. I feel like this is the boring part where I just paint fishes. I don't know. Oh, and yeah. And while I was drawing, I was doing other things as well, like, you know, looking at my grades, watching YouTube videos. I was watching JK News, and then I was like listening to like K pop music. And then I was watching Mommy Tang. And yeah, I don't know if you know them, but they're cool YouTubers, yo. More fishes. Okay. What else should I talk about? I guess I should talk about my life. But anyways, next week, I start summer school and I just ended school like two days ago, so like... I have school in two days, and I just ended school two days ago, so it's kind of like, oh, Too much back to back, they should give us like a week for you. And um, yeah, let's see how much time I have to draw. Okay, yeah, anyways, I'm just gonna chill here and I'll come back to my stuff later. Okay, I'm back. So that was pretty fast, but here what I'm doing is I kind of want to go to the scene because I don't think people care about the background because who the fuck cares about backgrounds, right? But this is painting the guy now and I think I've gotten better at painting skin because the thing about whenever I paint I tend to like overshade I add unnecessary amounts of different colors and hues and you know, saturations of skin so it gets kind of like kind of like I don't know just looks just looks just looks off but he here, I think I kind of like try to stop myself because you can't see right now, but on the face, only one side is shaded, but the other side is like not very, very like minimal shading to kind of like show that there's kind of like light shining it. And I'm saying like so much, I'll try to stop myself. Like, oh my gosh, she said it again. Okay, instead of using the word like, I should like use oh my fucking god, I just use the word like again. Instead of using the word like, I should use words such as similar or such as or similarly I don't know as something similar to that yeah I don't know this generation is going through phases of using the word like oh my god like like Ugh, I need to stop okay moving on so here I'm doing now is apparently drawing it oh my god this video is almost finished okay anyways 
that's pretty much it. And I just felt like I just talked too much. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys.